Hey, Odin. This one's on me, bud. And, and don't you come back around here, you one-eyed fuck. You could be a little more respectful, sir. Why? Can he take a joke? Oh. Uh, he, he's dead, right? Yeah. You know, I, I could really do this myself. You know, I could give you my room number and you could come and visit. Well, you know, I, I, I thought we were friends. Yeah, well, you know, you make me feel good. Okay, fine. You know, if you keep turning, I could get sick. Whoa. Nurse Edmonds. Nurse Edmonds? Kobe, I'm here. A word, Master. You fool. Sorry, but I found a way to get closer to your goal. Shh. What is it? This could be the next one to help with your quest. <laughs> Fuck your rules. Nurse, nurse, relax, relax. Your nurse is here. Shh, relax. I hate watch people suffering. My darling, I want to. Let's fix this, make you feel comfortable, okay? You want me to stop all your pain? Take all the misery away from you? Big nod for yes. Relax, baby. Relax. Relax. <sighs> Three now, five, four, three, two, one! Give me your soul. Shit! down here one more time to cater to you old geezers. And what are you looking at? Your buttons. My buttons? I'm so sick of this shit. Oh, slow down, jackass! <sighs> you are not gonna believe what I have just seen. Hey, honey. Listen. You're 50 years too late, Carl. Ah, did you hear the call? Yes, I was there, but... Where's Nick? He was right behind me when I came in. Nick! Get your ass over here now. I'm coming. Ain't no need to shout. But where am I? Nick. What? I got you, honey. What? Come on. Oh, God. You know, I really should have given him a lift. We're all gonna be dead before he gets here. Uh, I'm feeling death coming on right hey. now. Huh? Relax, Jack. Have a drink. Shh. Are you trying to get me in trouble again? God. Oh, damn. When did y'all get here? That's it. Okay, that's it, that's it. That is it! I'll be back. Where you going? I'm gonna go and I'm gonna try to piss if it's got anything to do with you. <laughs> TMI. Oh. 
occupied. You fucking deaf, it's occupied, asshole. Look, if you're not going to come in here and help me, then stop the fucking noise and go to the toilet down the hall. Oh, what are you going to do? You're just going to stand there and stare at me all day or are you going to help me up? Oh, Jack, Jack, Jack. I've never imagined a million years to say hello to you in man's toilet. A little bit stinking here, but so glad to see you again this morning. <laughs> uh, dear, why don't you just knock off all that chitty chat bullshit and get me up? Ha ha ha, I'm a girl. You're supposed to have a system, but I will help you. Just be nice, okay? Up, oh, up! Oh. 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 You're so hurt. this fucking thing. All right. Man can't even piss on his own. <laughs> if you could, you wouldn't need my help. You wouldn't stay in this facility, am I right? <sighs> this fucking place is a death trap. Listen to me. This place is a heaven compared to where you're going. Do me like a child. Go wash your hands. Go. What am I, fucking four years old? Hey, hey. Today is your birthday. You're one year old. Happy birthday, Jack. Go! Oh, yes. Take this. Well, you have a marvelous, delightful, wonderful day, Jack. And you can kiss my sweet little ass. Jack, I just helped you. Be nice to me, okay? For once. God, you're heaven. <laughs> Did you hear? What? Why is she crying? Doesn't she know she's not going to get in here for mascara? Shut son? up, Jack. What? Jack. Missy died this morning. Sweetie, sweetie, I'm so sorry. You know, I'm just, a, I'm just a, an asshole. Thanks, Jack. What? We have a killer amongst us. No, I'm serious. We have a soul-sucking demon. Not this again, Jack. Really? She was Storm's best friend. Yeah, now is not the right time for your bullshit, Jack. Look, we live in a facility where someone dies every week. Come on, we've got to get used to it. Ah, oh, shit. Ugh. All right, all right, look, look. I did this, I did this. Um, I, I'm going to fix it. I'm going to fix it. Jack. No, oh, let him go, man. It. it was my pleasure, sweetheart. And you know, I am very sorry that what I said in there um, upset you. You know me. I'm just a big asshole. <laughs> You're just being you. I know you got a heart. Here. Thank you. For what? Now we gotta get another body in here. The patients don't think about how the death affects this facility. I'm sure today's gonna be a sad day for everyone. Uh, no. Now we're gonna lose out on the Social Security payment. You know, the daily rate? You did that on purpose, you little shit. She may be dead, but to a lot of us, she was a friend. And more than that, she meant more than your fucking check. I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. I gotta go fill this bed. All right, death jockey, hold it. I'd like to thank you for bringing her out through the front door and giving her a little bit of dignity. 
made Storm feel so much better. Thank you. You're very welcome. Honestly, she's a fucking bitch. <laughs> uh, so, wanna go uh, kick some ass? Hi, Nick, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good. I want to know how your heart feels. Heart feels great. <laughs> Faster now. <laughs> <laughs> so, good news for you. Yeah, right. The test come back, it's negative. Ah. It's what we've wished for you. Ah, it's great results. Yes. Good, good for both of us. <laughs> <laughs> Let me ask you a question. A beautiful young lady like you that's so caring, are you married? Have you got a husband and children? No, I'm single. Oh. In life, we all have our missions. Yeah. My mission yeah. is to take care of people yeah. like you. Really? In what way? Let's see. For example, clean your glasses. Yeah. <sighs> Bring your breakfast yeah. and check your temperature. <laughs> I like that. I think everybody in here does. Oh, they really? Know, they know how caring you are. That's nice. Especially me. <laughs> mm -hmm. You'll be nuts. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Nick? Nick? Let's go. What? <sighs> Stop. You know, I like you and care for you, yeah. but do not ever do this again, okay? Do not do this again. Okay. You make me sad to do that. I don't like men to take advantage of me. You got it? I wouldn't do that. Don't. I wouldn't do that. Promise. I promise. Just in your imagination. Jack. <laughs> oh, fuck, that's good stuff. Yo, who's Dungeon Master? There you go. Jack's Dungeon Master. Where, where's, where are the other two? Jack and Storm. They're coming. <laughs> Maybe they're fooling around. Who? Oh, come on. Storm's got better taste than that. Besides, Jack can't handle that hottie. <laughs> <laughs> About time, Jack. Who's the dungeon master? Let's play. I was last week. Not me. Otto. Oh, that is such a beautiful dress. Here we go. It's a fucking cloak, you asshole. <laughs> and we're playing cosplay day. Who's the fucking dungeon master? What? I'll do it. <laughs> I declare as Dungeon Master. Yes. All right. When we left off the last time, there was a fight starting. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. So everybody gather up your dice and roll for initiative. You know, I'm glad I'm not the Dungeon Master. Older I get, the less rules I can remember, <laughs> damn it. Yeah, man. Dungeon Master had a different meaning when I was in prison. Oh, my God. Feel me? <laughs> Truly. I mean, like... Do, do jailhouse rules apply? You didn't play this in prison. How'd you know? Where's Storm? She's yeah. outside watching Missy leave. You know, I convinced that uh, death jockey to take her out the front door. Because the back door is just not dignified. That's what she said. <laughs> but seriously, that was a pretty good thing you did, you awesome yeah. bastard. Thank you. Don't start, Otto. Start what? Being offensive. Look, I'm telling you guys, I saw it. So what? Now you did it, Jack. Look, I, I, I snuck in through the back door of the nice building. Nice cloak, Otto. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Check out my wizard hat. Oh, oh man. Yeah, that's good. That's good. <laughs> uh, 
Um, really know how ridiculous you all look? Don't be a shithead, Jack. Yeah, well, at least I'm not wearing a dress. It's a fucking cloak, you motherfucker! He bitched him. Joe has moved to a plot. Have you seen Jack Davis? Oh, he's at the activity room. Oh, I'll take him. I hate answering the phones. Thank you. Shady Acres, Heaven's waiting room. How can I help you? Yes, Dr. Morrow. Did you get the empty room cleaned up yet? Uh, yes, one of the nurses' ads is on it. I need it ready for the next body. The government does not pay for empty beds. I chop, chop. I understand we're, we're, we're working very hard to get the room ready just for you, doctor. Empty beds don't pay the bills, nurse. You sure? Oh, yeah. I, I understand. I, I'm out. I'm out on it. Let me help you. God. Jack? Mary, I, I need your help. What's wrong, Jack? It's happened again. Uh, more monsters, and beside that, my fucking wheelchair's got two flat tires. Are you taking your meds? Oh, fuck you, Mary. I am not crazy. Look, I have a problem with demons. All God. right. Calm down and don't take the Lord's name in vain. I'll try to get there soon. I would actually really hurry. You understand me? Get your ass into gear and get here as soon as possible. We do not have a lot of time. Do you understand me? Yes, Jack. All right. <sighs> so I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully I'll be here. <sighs> how are you doing, Carl? Hey, how you doing? Just trying to relax. It's hot out here. I know. I got a surprise for you. For me? Yes. A surprise for Carl? Yes. Close, Get out of here. Close your eyes. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Don't okay. cheat, okay? All right, I go cheat. I like surprises. I do. I like How surprises. How do you feel? Oh, that feels good. Oh, my God. Oh, I know what that is. That's... Mmm. Woo! Yeah, that's the wind from your kisses. <laughs> you call oh. me kisses right now. Yes, yeah, so open your eyes. Look, this is for you. Oh, wow. Do you like it? I do. That's elegant. Yes, I also know your favorite color thread. How'd you know that? Because you're passionate. I am. You like it? I love it. It's from my culture. Your culture? Tell me about your culture. My culture is uh, caring, loving, and passionate, just like you. Caring, loving, and passionate. I see all that in here. We'll take them. I've got a bed without a body. Regulation, smegulation. Just give me the fucking body. Dr. Personality showing how much she cares again. Keep moving, Otto, or she'll give you the digital exam again. Anybody else notice that uh, Otto seems to leave the games a lot? Whoa, Jack. Our bodies work differently. Don't nobody say a motherfucking thing about your damn drinking. Yeah, well, here's to that. <clears throat> Come on, guys. Huh? We're friends. I think Jack has a point, though. See? Haha, uh -huh. see? I think he's got a point. Bet you you do. Eat me. <laughs> Oof. How are you doing? It's funny. You forgot this in Starting. the hallway. Oh, thanks. Yeah. You feeling good? Yeah. Got a nice nap. Why you got a lot of hair? Mm, it's hereditary. May I ask you a question? Yeah, I guess. Keep a secret. Keep a secret. Okay. Yeah, okay. Do all men cheat on Earth? Fuck it, hey. Really? Absolutely. Do you cheat? If I had the chance, yeah. What about women? Women cheat. 
Woman? Woman. Yeah. Woman. Never cheat. Oh, come on. If you had the opportunity, you wouldn't cheat? If I got a chance? Absolutely not. Loyalty is my principle. Loyalty? Right. You don't believe me? Hell no. Listen. Men are the same. Pigs. Either on earth or in hell. Go fuck yourself. 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 Get off me, bitch. Okay, okay. Let me Sorry, everyone. So, everything come out all right? That's nasty. Jesus, Jack, there's a lady present. Yeah, and I'll tell you who else is present. And she's definitely up to no good. Hello, gentlemen. Fresh fruit for you. And some muffins. Jack requested, right? Enjoy it. Today's entertainment for all of you. Can somebody tell me what color of American flag is? Red, white, and blue. Red, white, and blue. Red, white, and blue. Watch this. What happened? Magic! Thank you. <laughs> now can you make yourself disappear? I'm so close to being released from this bed. I've been cheated. It hurts me so bad! I have a little bit uh, <laughs> trouble pee. <clears throat> Jack, why do you have to be so hateful to her? Yeah, she's always so nice and professional. Get up my ass! Yo, you should go apologize to her. That will never happen. Can't we just get back to playing the game? Yes. Yes, let's just get back to playing the game, all right? Please, Jack, tell her you're sorry. You can't go calling people a demon, Jack. Oh, God. You know what? I'm over this. If it'll make you happy and keep you off my ass, I'll go do it. All right? God! Excuse me. Yes? Uh, Nurse Edmund? Ah! Leave her the fuck alone. Look, I just want to apologize. Now's not a good time, Jack. Why? Jack, what do you need? I, uh... Did you just break the wheelchair? Dr. Monroe is gonna kill you, cost you thousand dollars. Let's find somewhere private, okay? I sort just want to apologize. Okay. Where are we going? Where Quiet. are we going? Quiet! You old drunk. She's for trash, you smell like shit. Why, why, why are we, why are we outside? Just shut up, okay? No, Just what? shut up, listen. <laughs> Jack, some mistakes you make in life have permanent damage, you got it? <sighs> now I have something very special for you. You ready for it? No. Driving Nurse Edmund's nuts. Storm, did you take the meds I put in the bed table? Awesome. Jack, go brush your teeth. You smell like shit. All right. I see you later, okay? Uh, Be nice. Uh, bitch. Did you see that? Did you? That piss took a long time. Not now, Carl. What happened? 
Jack! Calm down. I now know what she's doing. What? The bitch kidnapped me! Hey, gamers. Hello, Patricia. Patricia will do just fine. Yes, it is. It's time for yoga. So, I'm gonna need you to put your little D&D world away now. Oh, yeah. Sure, Trey. I think I'm still sore from last time. Oh. Yoga? I am not doing fucking yoga. It's off. I am out of here. Screw you. Okay, guys. Just a few more. Up in the sky. Did she escape? No, I don't, I don't use tape. Yeah, she's a naughty girl. Okay, guys, now we're gonna reach all the way to the floor, to our toes, as far down as you can go. You want me to go find her? Yes. Yeah, that yeah. would be great. Go right down, guys, focus on the exercise. Everything okay? Yeah, I just, I just gotta go pee. Storm, you need to quit. I've cut way back, and at my age, does it even really matter? It always matters. You don't even know how precious life is. I mean, your life. Yeah, right. Stuck in this place, slowly dying. This place is heaven compared to the alternative. Then what's that? Hell? It's your funeral. Don't say I weren't warned. I really care for you, Storm. I don't want to see you go before it's your time. Whatever. Okay. Yoga's almost over. Thanks, Carl. Man, that sure smells good. Can I have just one little... No, no, step back. We don't want your oxygen tank blowing up. Are you coming? Yes. Now leave me be. Ah. Carl. Hi. What are you up to? I went for a walk. You're supposed to have yoga. I was. You are not. You are not there at the scheduled time. Follow the rules, okay? Don't trick me. Now please go to the activity room now. Well, can you help me? This shit is heavy. Rule breakers need to be punished permanently. <clears throat> Smoking on this property is prohibited. Whatever. I just caught Storm out here with this. Unacceptable. My office now. I want it. I want my 100th soul. Shut. No, I have been watching you. You haven't heard a word I said. It's like I don't even exist to you. Doctor, don't get my patience. No, me. shut I up. Do. Listen to me. If you I say another you. word, you are fired. I swear to God, you're so and that's Stop it. The, I, no. God damn it. Why do I have to go through this? I can't do this anymore. Oh my God. Are you okay? I'm not okay. The doctor's in my ass all the time. I tell you a secret. I haven't been treated. 
corny like this. Please, please do not do this. You lost a wager. But as your number one wife, please do not do this to me. It's already done, darling. You have to spend eternity with the mortals. But I'm pregnant. I'm pregnant with your child. Fine. If you survive this, I'll give you an opportunity to earn your freedom. Stop, stop. <coughs> and that is done. Mama, please. Mama, Mama, have mercy, please. Please. All right. You may have your freedom if you collect 100 willing mortal souls. Until then, you are banished until you satisfy this requirement. 100 willing souls. That seems like he's a tusk. Darling, you are devilish. You only have 100 years to satisfy this task. 100 years? I will prevail! I will prevail! I will prevail! You get out of me! You out! Out! I will prevail! I will prevail! Yeah. Asshole! Since I'm here to serve you, let me help you. I don't want to call you stupid, but you've been faithful to me. You're really appreciated. I only serve you. <laughs> tell me, tell me. Yes, I'm running out of time. I only got a few days left. I have three. I have three souls. Three more souls I have to get before I have my freedom. Three more souls. Let's go. Still think she's evil. Enough, Jack. Let's just play another game. She grabbed me by the head. What did you say to her? Nothing. I was trying to fucking apologize to the bitch. Wait a minute. She was kind of bitchy when she caught me by the back door. Yeah, she gave me shit too. I'm gonna take this to Dr. Munro. Fuck it. Wait a minute, Jack. Do you think that she heard what you spouted off? Now you're telling me that she's unstable? Wait a minute. Wasn't you the motherfucker that said that Dr. Monroe was a vampire? And she had the kitchen add extra salt just to your meals? That turned out you just didn't follow your diet. You know what? You lot are the worst friends that anyone could ever have. Don't be a sad sack. You're too old to be a douchebag all the time. 24-7. It's almost lunch. Why don't we play this after lunch? You know what? Count me out. I'm not hungry. Catch you later. I'm gonna take a nap. Ugh, you still freaking smell like smoke. You sure that cigarette was not yours? Dr. Sutkot, I don't smoke. It's your illusion. It's your imagination. I don't smoke. It's, it's Seriously, you do one more wrong thing and you're so out of here. I'm done. Oh, you're okay? Nurse Edmonds, I'm sorry about earlier. I've had a crappy day. Storm, that cigarette smoke was yours? Yes. Please, doctor, are we done? I've been explained for half hour to you. You have not been yourself today. Doctor, I'm sorry. I've been nice to everybody, but the mosquitoes, they just got me everywhere. The itching is driving me crazy. Doctor, just because something isn't what you hoped, it doesn't mean you can be nasty to someone. Storm, aren't you having lunch? I'm not hungry. What, are you sick? No, I miss my friend. Doctor, are we done? I really want to go pee. Sure, whatever. I need to check if we're filling these beds. I'm done with you. Jack, you coming? Just give me a minute. Hey guys, Sean Cooter Phillips here with another video for you guys. And no, we are not doing a new DVD Blu-ray update video. Don't worry, I'm gonna have plenty more reviews for you guys soon for new and upcoming titles. Don't worry, but we're gonna be doing a soup. Oh, those people are so annoying. Are you feeling all right, Storm? Mm -hmm. 
I just want to come check on you. Thanks. So, so pretty. So, I assume you have family, right? I do. I have two children. I thought so. Do you love them? I love them very much, but they never come to see me. No worries. I'm here for you. Thanks. Now what? I'm hungry, Jack. Me too. Look, you guys don't think I'm crazy? Well, come on. Where? This is not a wild goose chase, is it? I want to eat. Yeah, well, Storm is in trouble. Get your asses up. <laughs> Please don't be so sad. You know, life is fragile. I know exactly how you feel. But your friend <laughs> is at peace in heaven. She doesn't care about you that much. <sighs> Just relax and rest, okay? Good nap would do you good. Thanks for not being angry with me about... Don't fret. I love you. Oh, it's forgotten. Okay? In her pills, I Jack, hold up a minute. We're missing lunch for this. Storm needs us. This is way too much walking for me. Jack, you better be right. Yeah, well, my only problem is I'm just hoping that we're not too late. Jack, we're just a group of old crippled people. What are we going to do if... You know, you're right. We are. We're just a group of old farts. What could we do? What could possibly happen? Oh, God, we might die or get killed. Gentlemen, where are you going? Beg your pardon? Why aren't you at lunch? We're going to check on Storm. She's with Nurse Edmonds. Now, can you please go eat lunch? Sure, Doc. You know, you guys do whatever you want to do. I'm going to go check on Storm. I'm going to the dining room. Turn around this damn tank is a pain in my ass. She's fine, Jack. You know what? Why don't you lot just go and fuck yourselves? You've been in here a while. <sighs> Doctor, please relax. I just want to make sure she's comfortable and feeling okay. Her friend died today, remember? You sure it's not to bum another smoke off her? Nurse Edmonds wouldn't do that. It's against regulations. She doesn't smoke. Yes, sir. Sorry, ma'am, I don't smoke. Then you don't need to hover over the patients. Doctor, you might remember I'm a nurse. That's my job. 
And there's other residents that can't tempt you with a cigarette. Doctor, you got too much eyeshadow today. You're a fucking moron, aren't you? Shh, shh, doesn't mean that. Carry on, nurse. Yes, doctor, I'll be right there. Thank you, Storm. I'm going to go check on others. Storm, you mentioned you felt you were being watched. It was her. I rolled on my side and thought I heard a growl. But did you see anything? She saw the demon. I don't know about the rest of you guys, but I've heard enough of this big mouth. Shut the fuck up, Jack! Oh, yeah? Well, you know what, Otto? Why don't you bring your little miserable fucking ass over here and bite me on mine? Guys, zip it. Jack, I think it's best that you find other friends to hang around with. Maybe you ought to see a shrink. <laughs> really? You've known me for 50 years. And now, you suddenly decide to tell me to fuck off! You know that's not what I meant. Jack, I don't like saying this, but you've been extra cranky lately. You're hard to live with most of the days. I'm getting sick of it. If you were in that fucking wheelchair, I'd kick your goddamn ass! And your drinking has been way worse than normal. Jack, if something's bothering you... Stop making excuses for him! Assholes. Whatever happens now is their problem. Oh, you have got no, to be kidding me. Look who's there all along. I have got to get the hell out of this death trap. It's time for you to kill my freedom, Jack. So, how long do we let him stay? Forever! Stop, Otto. He's been a friend of ours for a long time. He's gone from being snarky and to just abusive and the, the drinking he's doing, it's not helping none either. We're all old. Maybe Father Time? If it was that storm, it would be subtle stuff. Like how he plays D&D &D now. But saying people are demons and this place is trying to kill us? I tend to agree. And remember, last year he accused Dr. Monroe of being a vampire. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dead poet. Maybe there was something in my room. Or maybe... It was a night. Oh, hooey. The both of you have been listening to Jack too much. How do we prove him wrong? Otto, why don't we let it rest for the day? Talk to him again tomorrow and see if we can ask him to be a little more pleasant. And if he's an asshole tomorrow? He doesn't play D&D &D with us anymore. Agreed? Agreed. Agreed. Good afternoon. Oh, hello, sister. <laughs> Looks like you got your work cut out here. Oh, I sure do. This thing's a piece of junk. Oh, well, you just have fun. That bitch is full you. of shit. Fuck my luck. Taking this soul. Can I help you, sister? Just visiting with brother Jack. Should I call him? No, my child. Shh. I want to surprise him. We let him get away with it. That's crap. We just don't want to listen to his bitching. Yeah, he's been a real dick lately. Sorry. There is no need to apologize if he's a sleathen. Mary, you know we love Jack. You know Jack? <laughs> Jack has been a bugger ever since he gave up the priesthood. You sure about that? A priest? Oh, yeah. Jack? When he was 19? <laughs> He was the youngest priest in the city. I remember him talking a little about that. But I met him in college. Our dad died. May he rest in peace. Mom had no support. Damn. Now I feel really bad. Shit, me too. So Jack left the priesthood. 
and joined the army and sent his pay back to mom. Oh, knock it off. I'll go and see if I can find out what's going on. He's going to tell you there's a demon working here. Don't start again, Otto. Demon. He did mention a demon when we were on the telephone. <laughs> no, no need for that now. Oh, better safe than sorry. Now, <laughs> does he mention this demon presence when sober? God, I think I need to leave this earth. Please, take me into your loving arms. Take me to heaven, God. Please don't leave me here. Are you okay, Jack? Oh, God, what do you want? I'm here to help you. You want my soul. I'm your caretaker. If you want to help me turn into the demon. I'm not a demon, Jack. I'm your nurse, your favorite nurse. I want to go to heaven. If you let me go to heaven, then you get what you want. You can have my soul. Fair enough. That's exactly what I wanted. Jack, listen carefully. The doors to heaven and hell are both open. I need you to gain me your trust so I can help you to enter the right door. Father in heaven, please hear my prayer and forgive me all my sins. Jack, that doesn't do anything to me. Let me get back to my job, be your caretaker. Dr. Bullshit, either end my suffering and let me go to heaven, or get the fuck out of my room, demon. That's exactly what I want to do. End your suffering, allow you to go to heaven. Why you hate me so much? Right now, you can't come any closer. I can't come closer to you. It's because I don't want you to hurt me. You know as well as I do that that is bullshit. I don't think that you are aware of my past. You drunk idiot. <laughs> Cannot achieve anything. If I get rid of these rosaries, you can now become my nurse. But you have no invitation to take my soul. Jack, look at me. I'm going to take your soul, either you want it or not. Perhaps you're not aware of my power. I just want this to end easy for you. I really do not want to hurt you. Stop the bullshit. Become the demon. Our father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done in earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us. Mary? Yes? You know I only want the best for Jack, right? As we all do. I think what we need to do is sit down, talk. I'll meet you in the activity room. We didn't want to interfere oh, with your... It's part of my mission, serving God. You know that you're all my friends. 
Yes, ma'am. Storm, I mentioned something that they me and Jack... A, they heard a growl from my room. And so this is where all this demon stuff has come from. There's been a rash of deaths here. Jack's always nosing around. His tall tales have increased. And we're tired of him making accusations. Well, I'm surprised. He never mentioned that he has this ability to sense the true evil? I want to give communion now. Girls, can't give communion. That's not fair. I'm telling Mom. Hey. You want to help me find a puppy? I can't. My parents said I'm not allowed to talk to strangers. It'll, It'll be, be okay. okay. I have to go. <sighs> If I set you free, will you leave me alone and never come back? Swallow your fucking soul, kid! Who's that? That is pure evil. Why is it that I keep finding my residents wandering the halls? We're trying to smooth things over. Sister, do not take this the wrong way, but I don't care. Jack is not an ideal resident, and if he doesn't start acting the way that he should, I suggest you find a new facility. Well, bless you, Dr. Monroe. That's enough. These residents, including my brother, have rights. Yeah? Well, I suggest you check the contract because he has a behavioral clause. He is not the only one who yells. Oh, and don't forget about his drinking. That you allowed before he was approved to live here. You signed off. Just read the contract. You have wasted enough of my time. Oh. <gasps> Hopefully your prayers will fill the bed. Oh. I liked her better when she cared more about people than profits. It's too bad you don't have the contract to shove in her smug face. Yeah, she's a real asshole. <laughs> Sorry, Mary. She's a fucking turd. <laughs> you know, I'm sure that the drinking is mentioned in there somewhere. I'll be back. Dear Lord, help me help me, brother, and find his documents. Please keep my friends safe and shine your love on them. Amen. You forced me into this. Feel better now. You've made me! My God will protect me. Your God has forsaken you. Face it. The best thing you can do is to give me your soul. Or perhaps you can kill yourself. I will not be taken to hell by a demon. I've given you my words. Let me end your suffering. I'll take you to heaven. That's where you want to go, right, Jack? You have no choice but to trust me. Your friends aren't even here to help you. I don't want to die. I was angry. And for what I said, I will ask God to forgive me. I'm tired of this shit. Perhaps I cannot force you to give me your soul, but I can kill you. Oh, what a bad. Be doing it with your little son. No, Shut your mouth! Through the immaculate heart of Mary. Yeah! God, please destroy the power ah! of your mortal enemy! Shut your full mouth! And destroy the power of your great enemy! Your prayer has no power! You must die! The evil spirit who work with the devil! Go to hell! What?
You must die, Jack! Who's there? Nurse Edmonds, this is ridiculous! You! You made me suffer, you piece of shit! I'm gonna destroy you! Leave me alone, what the fuck? No! Thank you, Toby. Feed my master. Toby, leave us! As you wish, but I prefer to watch you feed master. You will enjoy it. Let me go and I, I can promote you myself! Shut up, Mickey! I can promote you! Cast them into the deepest abyss in hell, God! And chain them for eternity! Your prayer has no power! I think we ought to go check on Jack. Mary will be back shortly. I know, but it just doesn't feel right without Jack here. Ah! <laughs> Destroyed your wizard, give me that. Not your day, huh, Nick? No, I guess not. I'm gonna go check on Jack. Your dungeon master. Nick, when Mary gets back, we'll go together. Fair enough. Blow that for me for good luck. Show you how we used to do it in the joint. 18, baby! Let's go! Damn it! I counter with an invincibility spell. <laughs> what? <laughs> that deals you 12 damage points, Carl. What the Damn, sometimes I hate this game. You know how these spells are. They kill even the best demons. Jack! Watch it! I must feed while she's alive! Lord, you take possession of your kingdom which you have created! It is yours! Shut up! Stop letting the ass off him! Fuck you! Evan! You, you cold blood piece of evil bitch! Just like my evil husband! Oh, you care some money! You torture him! Now it's my turn! I can make you pay stop if you're willing to give me your son. <laughs> you can make my pay stop, you can have my son. Fucking beast! <laughs> Heavenly Father, oh, the rain was the heart of Jesus Christ. Oh, the immaculate heart of Mary. I repeat this prayer. <laughs> Jack, I don't have the best table of manners. You stole that woman's soul. I did not force her. She gave to me willingly. You witness it. <laughs> You want a bite? It's delicious. Assholes! You usually are. You only have two left. You need two more souls. Nothing will stop me from getting my freedom. Did you go check on Jack? No. We're about to. Well, I don't want to sound like my brother may be right, but... What? Not you two. Let her finish. Yeah. Guys, she's not the kind to be concerned. So you say shit well, just got real? What I was trying to say is that if Jack's not too far gone from drinking... I can't. Mary, I just can't. I can't listen to this crazy talk. I understand. I'm with you, Mary. Me too. Jack can tell pure evil. He gets these feelings. <laughs> it becomes almost irrational. <laughs> I'm a sinner. I'm old and frail and I need your help. I need your help. Just send that fucking bitch. Back to hell forever! Master, he's praying! You! I have defeated you and your God! No. Now it's time for you to die. I thought evil was just that. What's the difference between evil and pure evil? Well, evil 
is just man being evil with each other. You know those annoying habits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pure evil is when the most unspeakable things happen. And how do your uh, religious gadgets help? Otto! I didn't mean any disrespect. This just gives me reassurance. I mean, it doesn't have any superpowers or anything like that. It just brings me peace and keeps me centered on serving the Lord. And the holy water? More self-assurance? Oh, no. <laughs> this stuff has superpowers. Oh, yeah. You remember the exorcist, don't you? Yeah, yeah, it's on. like fucking napalm on demons. <laughs> Sister Mary. <laughs> Help me take jacks! Then I'll give you the honor of giving me my freedom. Give her her soul! Set my master free! Never! God, give me strength! Get off me! Stand in you bastard! Give us the reign of your... The heart of Jesus, the Immaculate Heart of Mary. I repeat this, this prayer with love to you. With every beat of my heart, every breath that I take. How many men. times I told you prayers are useless? Prayers are only shows the stupidity, weakness, and ignorance of human beings. You're afraid of God. Take his soul. He's tired of all of you. Do you know that? <laughs> it tastes like barbecue fat pig or the belly so fat. You're my next breakfast scrapper. <laughs> yeah! Ah, you ready? Toby, attack him. We're running out of time. Just take my soul. I can get. I can take my life for your freedom. I appreciate your dedication and loyalty, but... Tell me, don't do that. The bitch doesn't give a flying fuck about you. Master? I can't take your soul. You have to give me your soul willingly. I can't ask you to take your life. I'll take it. I'll, I'll give you my life. Tell me. She lured you here with a promise. What was it? Shut up! You know nothing about my word. If she'll listen to you, she'll end up just like you. I'm a priest, Toby. <laughs> Let me tell you what's in store for you. She will be taken back to hell. And you? You will be dead. She cannot promise you anything. A priest? What a joke! I will become a more powerful demon. Master, you promise. Yes, I promise with my heart. You will become a powerful demon. Yes. <laughs> oh, poor, poor Toby. Toby, you are going to be dead. The bitch cannot give you anything. Shut up, you. Was that an earthquake? What should we do? Stay calm. What was that? I'm going to Jack. You're not leaving this room. I have no toy. Sure you do. That is the sound of pure evil. Jack may not be able to be battling that by himself. Right now, I need everybody that believes in a higher up. Divine guidance requires true faith. True faith. Your faith. I'm not much of a religious man. Me either. I have faith in a higher power. You think you can help? I can try. This may sound funny. What? You think any of these will help? Actually, this is my favorite spell. We need to get up to Jack's room now. It sounds bad up there. What is that? What do you think you're doing? You can't be doing that there. You can't be doing it here. 
Right now, I don't think anybody's going to care. Well, then give it to me. I so miss smoking. <laughs> Sister Mary. Now, it's going to be bad. So if it gets really bad and intense, I want you to get the hell out of there. Okay. You ready? Ready. God bless you. God bless you. <laughs> Yippee ki yay! Motherfucker! <laughs> but you've served me long enough to know I always, always keep my obligations. I'll be most powerful demon. Toby, don't do it. Put the glass down. The dark souls always taste sweet yet spicy. Do you know that, priest? Why are you doing this? about my life. I was treated unfairly. I was abused. Please do not take this person. I do not want to end it this way. I care for all of you. But my father made a wage. I didn't have a choice. It was my last resort. This is the only way I can get back to being the princess of hell. The only path I can get to freedom from slavery. Forgive her, Father, for she knows not what she has done. Amen. It's quiet. Let's pray. How about we pray our own way, though? Fair enough. What are you doing? I'm preparing for war. Badass. Now, I want you to wait here. I'll call you to come in if I need you. Okay. What is this? Ha <laughs> ha. A nun? Get out of here! So, does she mean something to you? A nanny? A mistress? This has got nothing to do with her. You shut the fuck up! Go to hell, demon! <laughs> ah! <sighs> <laughs> you son of a bitch! Fool of shit! <laughs> Mary! <laughs> Bastard! Where's Mary? She's in there. Well, let's go! She's calling me in when she needs me. I done dragged this tank all the way down here just to be standing around. I smell sulfur. I'll go in first. I'll use my strength as long as I can. Whatever that creature is in there, I'm gonna shank it! Storm, you and I will use our D&D &D knowledge. This is crazy. <laughs> Whatever's in there, I think it's her. Last chance to back out. Ready? Set? Ah! Go! Roll for initiative, bitch! You bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome! You look fabulous! Welcome to my chamber! So let's see who's willing to give me my 100th as a level 19 wizard, I invoke the hold on this monster! Oh, oh, how is this possible? I've been kind to your storm and now! She's going to die! Let me take your soul! Did you take your man? 
What's going on? Something crazy going on on the third floor. All right, we got this. It's my lucky day. <sighs> With minutes to despair, I can kill a nun and take her soul. Bring a nun. I don't need your consent. Lord, help me. Send me help and strength to defeat this evil. Enough, it's enough. It's a whole <sighs> Fuck you. Take my finger. God damn it. I know. Oh. Get Nick to do that. Cleric spell. D and D ain't real. <laughs> <Asshole>. <laughs> well, if that's the case, we got nothing to lose. Let's fucking do it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna let you handle this. It's old people. How fucking bad? Yeah, 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 I got it. Is she okay? <gasps> what, what, what happened? A damn yeah. demon! A damn demon threw out the room. That's what, that's what happened. I need my 100 soul. You, huh? The bomb, huh? Hold, Nick. You're gonna try to hurt me, huh? What? You old piece of shit! You tried your best, but you failed. God damn it! Take that bitch she out! Finally helped you, demon! Ma'am, are you okay? You was the fucking bomb. Ah! Oh, officer. Jack, do you have any fight left? Let's finish the bitch. That's me, Jack. You're so sweet. God damn it! Yeah! No, it's time for you! All of you! <laughs> Time's up, bitch. And you fucking lose. Your time is up. My time begins when I have my 100 Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. The gift gives our trespasses. Shut the fuck up! Shut up, those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation. But deliver us from no! evil! No! The power, the 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 power and, and the glory forever. With the power of a level nine demon wrecker, I banish you, Glacier, back to the depths of hell, where you will no longer harm anyone in this game again. And as a level 20 cleric, I place this spell upon you, and you will never have the opportunity, for it will last 50 years beyond eternity. I declare the use of a spare dying spell this spell will last until you're supposed to cross over to the other side. Storm, it is not your time. Storm. Storm. <laughs> you fail. It's not like I didn't try. I tried everything, every possible way, and I collected 99 winning souls just to satisfy you. Bitch, 99 <laughs> is zero. No, it's not everything. You bet you just know how to fuck with all these slut ladies. Are you tired of that? No, I never get tired of that. Please, please, have mercy for me. I will, I will, I will, I will, I will, I will, I will obey you. I will, I will obey your wishes. Please. Silence, wench! I'm, I'm willing to, to be your favorite consort. I will serve you. It's not gonna be like that. You need to be punished for your insolence. <laughs> I, I, 
What am I gonna do? I will. I will satisfy you. You know what? No one can do what I did for you. Okay, remember those beautiful times. I made you so happy. Please remember that. Please give me one last chance. One last chance. I will show you how I can make up for the past. Please. Yes. Mama. 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 No. All right, uh, Nick. Come on, man. Do this. Here we go. All right. There's a a three-legged camel ridden by an 18-foot-tall ogre with one big eye, and he attacks your fortress and destroys the gates and all of your guards and takes you hostage. All right, let's okay. roll for initiative. Nick. Nick. You gotta let the die go. Storm wouldn't have done that, yeah, Nick. I miss Storm, on, Nick. Yeah, we all miss we Storm, all miss mate. It. He's right, Nick. Oh, I wouldn't whoa. have done that. She's <laughs> hey. Hey. Uh, Where did you come from? Wow. <laughs> I just got here. Yeah. I'm hungry, I need my soul. 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 I'm hungry. 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 I need